You might have heard about the ancient and historic wonders, but space, no. From NASA's Cassini to Messenger, the cosmos is ready to surprise you with wonders that will make you rethink your existence and dwarf everything this Earth is offering. Welcome to Astronigma, space enthusiast. Today with us, you are embarking on a journey through the cosmos to explore the eight wonders of our solar system. 1. The Rings of Saturn We will start with the mesmerizing Rings of Saturn, discovered around four centuries ago in 1610 by the Italian astronomer Galileo Galilei. They create a breathtaking spectacle, which can't be seen anywhere else in our solar system. When you look through the troposphere of Saturn, you'll see this ring system that stretches an astonishing 75,000 kilometers above your head. These icy rings are composed of countless particles, from tiny grains to big boulders. They are so shiny that they have the potential to light up everything around you. There as the sun sets, its rays bounce off the mist of ammonia crystals, creating a cool sun dog effect. There these superfast ammonia clouds, zooming past, at over 1,500 kilometers per hour, push everything away. These winds are some of the fastest in our whole solar system. And way down below, about 30,000 kilometers down, there's this crazy global ocean made of liquid metallic hydrogen. But trust me or not, you wouldn't want to try landing there. 2. Valles Marineris, Mars Let's talk about the red planet, Mars, where we have Valles Marineris. Astronauts have been known to drop to their knees and shed a tear at the sight of Arizona's Grand Canyon. Imagine being the first person to set eyes on the Mariner Valley. In 1971, discovered by the Mariner 9 spacecraft, this colossal tectonic fissure spans almost 6.5 kilometers in depth and stretches as wide as a quarter of the United States. That's a whole lot of canyon. And get this, sunrise at one end happens about six hours before it does at the other end. At one point, water used to flow through big chunks of this massive expanse. Have you wondered how it must have felt to stand there at the edge, with the icy mist swirling around the valley as the sun dips below the north rim? It's quite a sight to behold. 3. The Geysers of Triton Discovered by the British astronomer William Lassell in 1846, we come across our third wonder, the enigmatic moon Triton, the largest moon of Neptune. This frozen world, with its nitrogen frost covered surface, is home to a spectacular array of cryo geysers. Probably made of nitrogen frost and some dark organic stuff, they look smoky and can be heard from miles away as they shoot up over 8,000 meters into the thin atmosphere. But before you know it, the tops get whisked away by the winds. Plus, this place is covered in methane and nitrogen ice, and it's so darn cold, with temperatures dropping to nearly minus 200 degrees Celsius. Talk about chilly with the Triton. Studying them allows us to explore the outer reaches of our solar system and search for signs of habitability in the most unlikely places. If you ever swing by Triton, you're in for a wild show. 4. Jupiter's Great Red Spot our cosmic odyssey takes us to the gas giant Jupiter, where we encounter one of the most iconic features in the solar system, the Great Red Spot. Jupiter's got this ginormous storm, the biggest one in our whole solar system. And guess what? You can only see a tiny part of it from where we are. It's towering at least 8 kilometers above the clouds around it. Lightning bolts are snapping like crazy at the base, ready to zap anything in their path and those winds at the edge, blowing around at over 400 kilometers an hour. This monster spins counterclockwise once every seven days, creating some seriously rough turbulence and a loud roar. It's so huge that you could fit at least two Earth-sized planets inside. And get this, it's been raging on Jupiter's southern side for a whopping 400 years, with no signs of calming down anytime soon. A colossal storm larger than Earth itself serves as a reminder of the immense power and scale of the gas giant's atmosphere. 5. The Geysers of Enceladus Discovered in 1789 by the British astronomer William Herschel, Enceladus is one of the major inner satellites of Saturn. It orbits at 238,000 kilometers from Saturn's center and 180,000 kilometers from its cloud tops. Here we encounter another wonder of the solar system, the geysers of ice. As we travel to Enceladus, we are confronted with the silent violence of its ice geysers erupting into the void of space. You can sense it before you can even lay your eyes on it a deep ominous rumble vibrating through your chest and up from your feet. You can feel it all in your body. It's so quiet here 
almost eerie. And then, out of nowhere, boom, two massive ice plumes shoot up from the surface of Enceladus, hurling ice crystals into space faster than a speeding bullet at over 1600 kilometers per hour. It's like a silent explosion illuminated by the distant sun. Walking on Enceladus won't be a walk in the park though. With just 1 16th of our own moon's gravity, it's going to be a challenge. Better pack some jetpacks and watch out for those valleys where these powerful geysers erupt. Safety first. 6. Sunrise on Mercury Now let's turn our attention to the closest planet to the Sun, Mercury. Discovered by ancient civilizations thousands of years ago, Mercury offers a celestial spectacle unlike any other. Sunrise and sunset on Mercury are like nothing you've ever seen. The Sun looks massive and two and a half times bigger than what we see here on Earth. And it seems to rise and set twice during a single day on Mercury. First it pops up, then it kind of cruises across the sky, takes a little pause, then starts heading back the other way, before pausing again and finally making its way to the horizon. It's like a little dance up there. And the reason for this funky show? Well, Mercury spins three times for every two orbits it makes around the Sun, and its orbit is super wonky kinda like an oval, so that's why we get this cool aerial performance every day on Mercury. 7. Peaks of Eternal Light For the seventh wonder, we won't go far from home. Right on our own moon, there's this crazy cool thing going on. Back in 94, scientists stumbled upon it in the Peary Crater near the North Pole. They call it the Peaks of Eternal Light. And get this, the sun never sets there. Yep, you heard that right. It's the only spot in the whole solar system where the sun just keeps on shining. How cool is that? And it's all because the moon's tilt is just right, so it's always basking in sunlight. They say this place is gonna be a hotspot for tourists someday, and hey, maybe even the first moon base. Plus, the temperatures there don't fluctuate much, only by about 20 degrees, which makes it perfect for settling down. Imagine exploring this lunar wonderland with temperatures remaining relatively stable and the possibility of water ice adding to its allure. And hey, there's even a chance of finding some water ice there too. Talk about a bonus. 8. Herschel Crater on Mimas Last but not least, we venture to Herschel Crater on Saturn's moon, Mimas, discovered by the American astronomer William Herschel in 1789. Brave climbers who make their way up the peak at the center of Herschel Crater on Saturn's moon, Mimas, will find themselves over 6,000 meters above the floor of the basin. Imagine being surrounded by crater walls that reach nearly 5,000 meters high, with Saturn setting in the background. It's quite the sight, right? Travelers might start wondering how on Earth Mimas survived the massive impact that created this whopping 139 kilometer wide crater, which is almost a third of the moon's diameter. It's mind-blowing stuff. And there you have it, fellow space travelers. The eight wonders of our solar system showcase the beauty and diversity of our cosmic neighborhood. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more captivating adventures with Astronigma. Until next time, keep exploring the mysteries of the universe.